in Dragon Ball Super Episode 78, we got to see Bazil take on Majin Buu in an epic first round. This is just the beginning. We finally got to see some of the characteristics and properties of these new fighters, Bazil being extremely fast and using his feet as his main attack source, absolutely pummeling Boo. However, at the end of the episode, we see Boo crack a smile as if Bazil's attacks did absolutely nothing to him, which I'm sure they didn't. Going into episode 79 preview, we see the battle continue as Boo throws a series of energy blasts at Bazil. He's finally beginning his counterattack, yet Bazil Basil is just blocking all of them with his feet. Presumably, the first half of this episode will be Boo continuing to quote-unquote lose in this fight. However, then we see Boo get all up and close with Basil. Basil is obviously not too happy about that. Considering that Boo thinks that he is a dog and this is a game, Basil, frustrated that he can't do any damage to Boo, then is going to transform into some werewolf type being so we got this picture at the very end of the episode 79 preview and it's very clear that Basil is going to get a transformation here you can see the pigment the color in his eyes has changed his hair has flared up a little bit more kind of like a super saiyan and his body has grown slightly larger so this is kind of reminiscent of some type of werewolf transformation we can see that the Kai Ro is smirking because obviously he knows about this transformation and he's probably thinking in an internal monologue or something of the sort that Basil is about to lay the smackdown on Boo. However, they show this clip of him right here sweating and looking very nervous actually before they showed him smiling so I think it was out of order and I think what's going to happen is he's going to transform and he's still not going to be able to do anything to Boo and it's at that point that we see Ro and Sidra looking very nervous as well as Basil is probably losing the fight. We get this very interesting looking glare from the great priest and I'm predicting that this is basically him preparing to yell to the audience that Boo has won, Basil is out, and we're on to the next round. Then we get a glimpse of Gohan preparing with a menacing look as he is about to enter the ring. So my prediction, guys, Basil transforms in this episode, 79. He's still not able to do anything. Boo ends up winning the fight, and then Gohan is up next, and that image, that really awesome looking image that we got of Gohan right here, is him taking off his glasses, punching his fists, and get, getting ready to jump into the ring. And that's how episode 79 is going to end, with episode 80 preview should give us some glimpses of Gohan fighting against Lavenda, which I am extremely excited about. So the real question remains, do all the wolves have the ability to transform into this super wolf or werewolf type transformation? I'm going to assume yes, and if that's the case, I have a feeling that Gohan is going to struggle very badly. Transformations are nothing new to Dragon Ball, as we've seen so many characters transform. Super Saiyans, Frieza, Zarbon, and the list goes on, and those are tr talking about transformations that they can do at will, as well as other characters that transform like Majin Boo and Cell. So transformations are nothing really new here. I think it's very possible that the strongest three fighters from a universe would have some type of transforming ability in order to gain a strength boost. And I think that's definitely what we're going to see here. So while we saw Goku smashing Bergamo from the trailers and the clips that we got, I have a feeling that Bergamo is going to be able to transform into a hulking beast, and it's actually going to be a really good fight with Goku against Bergamo in the end, but I have a feeling now that Lavenda is going to transform, and he is going to beat Gohan, pushing Gohan to go into training mode after this tournament, considering that he feels like he almost got his entire universe destroyed. So guys, I'm not going to be making many videos this week. I am knee deep in Anime War Episode 2. I really, really want to get this done by the 24th of February. So I probably won't be making a lot of videos this week unless we get some major spoilers or breaking news information that comes out. So just be patient with me, guys. I'm working really hard on Anime War. The whole team is. We're going to bring you a fantastic episode that you can rewatch a hundred times. I promise you that much. Have a wonderful Monday, guys, and I will see you soon for some more videos maybe the middle of the week maybe next weekend but taking a little break from videos to grind anime war out so have a wonderful day everybody thanks for all your support and i'll talk to you soon peace